Hello everyone, welcome back to FFG Live. My name is Evan Johnson and I'm joined here today by Brian and Katrina. It's me. Uh, and so we are here today, we're gonna play some Arkham Horror Final Hour, which was a game that came out last fall actually, uh, but we wanted to get it back on the table. We wanted to, to see it again, kind of run through it, and maybe if you haven't seen this before, uh, this will be something that, that is interesting. Or even if you have played this game, uh, you can still just hang out with us as we, as we play it. Uh, it's a, so I guess in, in, by way of a, maybe a premise or a, a short synopsis to, to start out with. So Arkham Horror Final Hour, uh, quite unlike a lot of Arkham Horror games that you may be familiar with. It has, of course, the, the themings of Arkham Horror. You know, we're playing as these, uh, these characters that you'll recognize, right, uh, from other places in the series. We're facing off against an ancient one, in this case, Umordhoth. But uh, rather than a lot of our other Arkham Horror games, which kind of have more of a slow build, they have you know some investigating and some like I'm gonna go and I'm gonna like buy guns or whatever and like look for clues under like stumps or you know <laughs> I, I don't know like that sort of thing. Uh, this is this takes place as you can see from the board and all of these monsters that are everywhere. So many monsters, oh. Evan. Yeah. I don't know what you were doing when but, you set up this game. I was man. like, wow. <laughs> Are we starting mid-game, or does it just start this way? Yeah, it, it, uh, it just starts this way. This is the way it do work. Um, so, basically, uh, there's monsters everywhere. This is kind of towards the, the end, I guess, of a traditional Arkham Horror investigation. The ritual has been performed. This is the ritual site right here. Uh, the ritual has been performed, and things are bad. And uh, there's monsters everywhere, and we're going to need to kind of figure out our way to get through that. So I really uh, don't appreciate the students just taking over the student union for eldritch activities. Yeah, exactly. What are those students up to? <laughs> <laughs> I always knew there was some fishy stuff going on at that student union, man. Yeah, yeah. If it's anything like the student union at my college, then... Uh, Yes, there's, a, there's always fishy oh, stuff going oh, okay. on. Spontaneous Eldritch. <laughs> yeah, you know, you know, it, it happens. <laughs> Kaufman is known for such things. Um, all right, so uh, let's kind of get into it, and I'll I'll quickly run through sort of what we're doing here. There are two phases. There's the, the sort of an action phase where the investigators are doing things, and then there's the ancient one phase where bad stuff happens. A familiar tale. A tale as old as time. <laughs> the ancient one phase. Some might say. <laughs> um, we each have a deck of cards like this, and this these cards, they each have two effects. They have a top half, which is good, and they have a bottom half, which is uh, less, point, so good. less good. Not yeah. sometimes it's just less good. Sometimes it's actively bad. Yeah. <laughs> uh, it depends on the card. There's a spectrum, and we're each going to we're we're each locked in to this top card, right? This is like the card that I can do this round. Uh, and but I can't communicate with you guys whether I need the top half or the bottom half to happen, except by way of these priority cards that I have in my hand. These cards just basically have numbers on them like 1, 10, 17, you know. Um, so I'm going to place my action card face down with a priority card face up on top of it. And that is going to kind of uh, be my only way to signal to Brian and Katrina mm -hmm. how important it is that I get the good half of my card. Uh, and we're gonna go around and we'll see how well we can kind of silently <laughs> yeah. communicate with each other. Um, and away we'll go. Yeah, so, I don't know that communicate is the right word. I feel it's just like we've got Michael McGlenn who's gonna do all the shooting, yeah. Lily Chen is gonna do all the punching. Yeah. I'm obviously just gonna wave my wads of cash around. Yeah. But monsters <laughs> will just leave. At, at I'm monsters. Sure you'll yeah, we have two pistols too. I feel like there's gonna be a lot of. A lot of monsters just getting taken out of here. Probably, probably lots of shooting, yep. you know, or, or you know, throwing money at them, you know, however you want to interpret that. <laughs> yeah, right? like shooting like pennies at them. Like maybe, yeah. maybe you're a cultist of an ancient one, <laughs> but if someone offers you 50 bucks, are you still a cultist yeah. of an ancient one? And 50 bucks in 1926. That's a, that's a lot, lot of money. Yeah. That's a lot of money. Yeah. Yeah. Forget you were ever here. <laughs> that's good money. Okay, so, uh, so to start with, we each look at this uh, card that we have on top of our decks and we start thinking about what kind of priority we want to put on that. So I'm looking at the board 
and I cannot communicate what is uh, what is going on to my compatriots, but I'm going to put that card down, and I'm going to put a priority card for my hand face up on it. So I've got I threw the ten down Ooh. on that. I draw a priority card to replace it, and now it passes over to BK here. Ten, huh? Yeah, ten. That's about a, a ten priority is right. worth of uh, solidly in the middle of action. Is that in the middle? What's the range? It's, it goes to thirty. Okay. So. Oh, is it thirty? So, okay, oh, I forgot. So you're kind of yeah. betting low there a little, or is that the highest card he has? <gasps> <laughs> <laughs> you, did, you did show the one earlier. Did you put that back in your hand? I'm just. Yeah. Waiting I, I did. Okay. I did. That's it's meta gaming. Yeah, yeah, I know. <laughs> I'm already breaking the rules here a little bit. No okay. cheating. No cheating. <laughs> all right. All right. Here we go. Mm -hmm. So basically, we're gonna we're gonna pick what actions we want to do, and then we're gonna resolve them, and then uh, after that, then bad stuff is gonna happen. the The ancient one we're playing against is Umordhoth, the Devourer below, and they are all about uh, ghouls. So there's a couple of ghoul hordes here at each of the gate locations around the board, and basically they're going to have they're gonna hunt. Um, based on uh, where they, uh, on how many of these uh, reckoning symbols we have in our priority card. So wait, so you need to play a yeah. priority card on no, that. No. Okay. I was letting you explain. Oh, oh God. yeah. Okay. But I'll, I'll go like this just yep. to keep things moving. Yeah. All right. All right. And so now, this being a four player game, I'm going to play a second card since I'm the lead investigator here. Uh, let's see. You got to pull your weight for two, Lily. Yeah, I think this is I think this is okay. I think we're gonna put this down, put a nineteen on that. So we're gonna comfortably go last there. Okay. Yeah. okay. So now we're gonna resolve starting at the top. I already forgot. Sorry. Oh yeah. Yes. yeah. Make sure you draw your priority cards. Alright. Uh so Katrina has played a nine, which is the lowest number, so you get to go first. What is Jenny doing here? So clearly there's a grand gala in the student union. Oh, that you have to get to. Yes. <laughs> um, move up to one time, then in turn order, each investigator attacks monsters at his or her location for damage equal to twice the number of priority cards he or she played this round. Whoa, Ooh. each of us attack. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Well, you said this game was all about shooting monsters, so I yeah. thought we would just launch right into yeah. it. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and Let's take them out. Importantly, one of the ways that we lose is if this ritual site is overrun by monsters. Okay. Because yeah, if so that happens, then we're, we're donezo. So we need to protect this, the student union. Protect the students. Yeah. Right. Really. So I get to move, because I, I assume it's not each investigator, just me. Uh, yep, correct. All right. You, you would get to move. Well, these dimensional atrocities seem pretty gross, so I'm going to head over to the athletic facility. Yeah. Um, because I've got two guns, one for each monster. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So then in turn order, which I guess starts with you. Right. Um, you get to attack monsters at his or her location for damage equal to twice the number of priority cards you've played this round. Cool. Ooh. So I've got I've got four yeah. uh, oh, that's total perfect. four, which is yep. which is enough to yep. take out both of these boys. Nice. So they're not going back in the monster cup. We've uh, once it's drained, okay. then we'll, then uh, we'll get our, yeah. our we'll fresh get, wave we'll get of even monsters. more. Yes. Great. Uh, and there are no monsters now at, at your location. Sorry yep. about that. So. But hey, you can take out those guys over there, <laughs> which seems good. Take out one of them, and so they've got red and blue monsters, which denotes which track they're going to. So are we more worried about the fraternity row or the humanities? Well, there's more monsters going over here, so I'm gonna take out this guy. You can take them out, both of them out, right? Because it's twice the number of uh, priority cards, right? I've only played one, so that's why I thought that I only get to do one damage, and you had played two priority cards, which is why I did two. Uh, for damage equal to twice the number of priority cards. So you played one, so twice the number is oh, twice. two. Oh, yes, yes. So I think, I think you're good. There we go, yeah. Sweet. Clear it out. Yeah. I just can't do math. <laughs> <laughs> I know money, but I've never had to count it. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, who needs to count it when you have that much money, right? You're just like, hmm, I'm just going to throw some money at it. Doesn't matter. All yeah. right, and that is uh, your turn, I believe. Yeah. All right. So let's see what we got here. Uh, 
empty hand, move up to two times, then attack monsters at your location for two damage. If I attack at least one monster with the, the horror symbol, uh, I attack for three damage instead. So I kind of want to, is there a big, a big nasty one that I can go after? Um, not actually that I am nah. seeing. I am going to go, hmm. I might just slide over here to one, allow me to quickly see what's heck gonna happen this time. <laughs> yes, I'm gonna. Oh, good, you can reference your cards if you need to. I'm gonna slide over here to the Dorothy Upman Hall, upside down reading abilities, yep. <laughs> uh, and I'm gonna I'm gonna take out this looks like a Biaki of some kind. No Biakis, they're bad news. Yeah, yeah, we don't want any of that. Yeah. Nope. All right, uh, that is my turn there. It's going to come right over to me here. Yep. And so now you are going to be doing the bottom oh, half of yeah. your card. I hope you planned for this. I, I did, you know. Okay. Um, it's not great, but uh, move up to one time, then investigate your location. Okay. Yeah. I think I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to follow Evan over here. There's a lot of different paths I can take. I'm going to investigate here. It's a little star. So I'll explain that briefly right here there. how the how these work and what we're doing here. So in this game, you're kind of playing like a little game of mastermind on the side. Uh, we're trying to find the ritual components is what are what these are. Uh, we want to isolate what components were used in the ritual. So we're going to be running around and trying to investigate these places and eliminate possibilities, right? So we could eliminate like if we get rid of both of these, and it's like okay, there's no hourglasses that were used there, and so on. Mm -hmm. um, so that ideally, by the end of the game, uh, when once all of the gates have, have spawned down, uh, we'll be able to use the priority cards in our hand to reverse the ritual. So that's what, that's what we want to get to. You ready for the bad stuff? Oh, there's bad stuff? There's bad stuff. Yeah, I okay. investigated. Oh, then a monster spawns at each gate. Oh, oh. snap. Yeah. All right. So go ahead. Make sure that you pull... Easy monsters. Yeah, exactly. Oh, hey, look, that one's pretty easy. Nice. Yeah. Uh -huh. so he can, he can live over there. Yeah. That one, also pretty easy. All right, we got Gribbly number one. We got a cultist. Oh, look at this. Great pulls. Oh, good awesome. stuff. Best contribution to the game thus far. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. All right. All right. I believe that's me. That's what you got. Yeah. All, right, All right. Let's see what we got over here. So I'm doing the bottom half of my card. Uh, move up to one time, then investigate your location. And then I have to activate some monsters. Uh, I'm going to swing up over here to Sorority Row. Let's see what we got here. All right. Hourglass. Speak of the devil. Yeah. Not as likely. Okay. So then we are... <laughs> Uh, activating monsters in the orange zone, which means basically those monsters are going to each mm -hmm. do their they're going to do their thing. Do their thing yeah. Yep. So this whole zone. Yep. So we'll just start here. So this guy, he's not doing anything. Cultists, they just hang out. He's hanging out. This this guy, he wants to hurt someone, but there's nobody there. Oh, so far, so good. Yep. Uh, up here, these guys want to hurt people, and they're not doing anything either. They're all They're playing. scaring lots of students. How can <laughs> you be so callous? <laughs> Nothing here. Uh, 14, so he's going to slide on over. So oh, he, he's got a move type. Yep, yep. He, he's got the move type, and he is red, so he follows the red arrows. So he slides over there. This guy, he's just tearing up the place, there, breaking down for row. Yeah. So he's breaking Smashing stuff. Smashing stuff up. Oh, no. I don't like that. They were already losing stuff. Yep. <laughs> and then these guys, so this guy's going to... Move down over here, and this guy's gonna break some stuff as well. Oh, man. So we just don't want them to completely destroy Student Union or completely fill up Student Union. Correct. Okay. Yeah. That would be bad. That would be that would be bad. Seems Possibly bad. the end of the world. <laughs> <laughs> tornado of death over here just showing up. Yeah. That's what Immortoff looks like to me. A tornado <laughs> of death. Yeah. A tornado of corpses, perhaps. Yes. <laughs> All of his ghoul minions. Yeah, that uh, that, that seems likely. Yeah. Uh, all right. So then we go to the ancient one phase. So first we do reckoning. So we're gonna discard all these priority cards. Mm -hmm. uh, but first we count up the reckoning oh. symbols. So we got four showing. Oh wow. Okay. That seems like a lot. Good job, team. All right. So. 
Uh, nowhere to hide is the what happens in that sense. <laughs> uh, the ghoul hordes are going to hunt for two, then remove one seal of your choice from the board. Well, fortunately for the, us, we have placed no seals. Yeah, so, hates them. <laughs> uh, so hunting ghoul hordes is kind of a special thing with this scenario. So it says, in any order, each ghoul horde moves uh, two times, but does not occupy a monster space until after its final move. If the ghoul horde exits or enters an investigator's location, that investigator loses one health. Okay, well, that seems serious. So, yeah. so these guys, he's gonna go one, two, and this one is gonna go one, two. And those ghoul hordes, you can tell them because I got the yellow. Yep, that is correct. This one's gonna go one, two. So they're they're still comfortably far away from us for now. For so, now. So. We should be we should be just fine. Yeah. Everything's fine it's, here. It's yeah. great. It'll all be good. I'm I'm feeling very confident. Yeah. Yeah. Alright. Uh, so let's go ahead and do the gate. So if you oh, want I've got to... the little gate tokens over here. Yes. So it's the three little circles here. Where's that? Oh, all the way on the other all side, the way of course. On the humanities oh, building. There we go. All right, so it's just like piling up you just like pile this. It, yep. And then uh, I you believe spawn, uh, two, two monsters. Well, there, there's plenty you know. of monster space. There all we go. Of those. Just some more cultists. Okay. Yep. Good yep. pull. Good some pull. Some art yep. students decided that you yep. know they'd throw oh, in with some the monsters. more cultists. All right. Oh, yeah. Oh, we, so we can... far, <laughs> pulling out of this cup. Yeah, yeah. we're saving it all the bats so for later. We can wipe out these guys. Yeah, that's good. That's good. Uh, all right, and I'm gonna pass the lead investigator. Oh, thank you. Yes. Over to you, BK. And we are back to the action phase. Okay. So, I'm take it away, to, sir. I guess I can put a pile up on here, right? Go. Huh. Got some good stuff there? Good, I got, good I got stuff, some interesting, stuff. interesting things. <laughs> Check my pads here. Okay. There we go. All right. Oh, before I forget. I'm gonna take a look at mine ahead of time. <sighs> hmm. Evan, what's your opinion of Mordhoff? My opinion of Mordhoff? Yeah. Uh, probably not overall good for the world is, hey. uh, is kind of my opinion, I would say. Uh, he seems like, although, so, you know, hunger for flesh, uh, that's something that I feel on, yeah. a, on a daily basis. So you can relate to you know, off. so <laughs> right? It's so like, I guess we're all carnivores here. Yeah, it's like I've, 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 I've felt such things. Uh, in in uh, oh. in my life, uh, oh. I'm not gonna play. I that just one. realized that I have to go twice this go. turn. Yeah. There we go. We're going with Make that. Make it one. count. Oh no! <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. Just you know, Jenny's cleaning up after a mess. Yep, yep, yep. Oh. As as per usual. Did not plan for this. <laughs> you got the got the goods. Uh, that's not but great. You can you can choose now, knowing like where you'll fall in the yeah. water. Yeah. You have all of this wisdom <laughs> at your fingertips. Uh, what will you do with well, it? You know, the problem is my priority cards are just not that great. Mm. <laughs> mm. So, oh, oh my goodness. Right. Wow. Gotta make sure I'm stocked. Gotta stock up on priority cards. All right. Uh, so number eight is the first. All right. So I was saying that I wasn't going to kill a lot of people before, but actually I was kidding. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so resolve the following effect two times. Attack monsters at your location or an adjacent location for two damage. Whoa. Because I'm using my twin 45s. Oh, yeah. So yeah. Does it really matter where I got them? I don't think so. Yeah. <laughs> so I'm really, like, not happy about, um... Oh, this guy's a destroyer, right? Mm -hmm. So he's adjacent to me, so I think I'm gonna have to. I would recommend. I, I can I can handle. Oh, you can handle. Yeah, them. I yeah. I can handle oh, these monsters. Okay. There. I've okay. got these monsters up here. Cool. So then what I'll do arts. is I'll get rid of this because uh -huh. he's 
Is he adjacent, even though there's not a pathway? Uh, he's not adjacent. Oh, no, okay. for you, adjacent is, is the pathway. This is a lie. This was a deception. Yes. yes. <laughs> <laughs> Those right. monsters, they just cut through the forest. Yeah, yeah so I'm going to get rid of these two, because that's two damage yeah. at an adjacent location. Yep, absolutely. And then I'm going to do two damage to him, because he's like big and bad, but... Yeah, well, so... Will it last? No, it won't. Oh, it no. doesn't persist. Oh, so, no. So you just want to... So I got to do another... Up Maybe you, there's a cultist, another cultist down there. Yeah, that, okay. That, well, if you're going to take out Sorority Row, then I guess I can just clear out humanity. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right. Clearing out the bad guys. All right. Is that your whole effect? Yeah. Okay. Uh, that's my turn. Measured force. Move up to one time, then destroy one health, a two health, and a three health monster at your location. Ooh. Uh, I'm not going to move. I'm just going to... Yep. Clear out these boys like here. Nice. I like that a lot. Good job. Yep. No monsters in Sorority Row. That's my <laughs> promise to you. <laughs> <laughs> Running for student body president. Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> Lily Chad, student body president. <laughs> no monsters. Lily Chad approves this message. Here we, here we come. Michael McGuire. I am once again asking you for no monsters in Sorority <laughs> Row. <laughs> All right. Uh, yeah. Here we go. What do we got? <laughs> Messing stuff up. <laughs> All right. All right. Uh, move up to one time, then investigate your location. So, I mean, that's... Oh, it seems good. This is okay. That seems good. You went over there, so yep. uh, I'm going to come down here. Yes. Grab this guy. Little diamond. Okay. Okay. Put that there. Yep. Good um, to know. Yeah. So, that's that's fine. Uh, and then the bad stuff starts to happen. Uh, then two monsters spawn at my location. They could tell that you were like rooting around for something in the science building. <laughs> Maybe you shouldn't have broken that flask on the ground hmm. that resulted in something terrifying coming out. We've got Isn't more dimensional the shambler. Best thing mm. that happened. Okay. Yep. And, yep. Uh, and two monsters. Yep, that's it. That's, you know, not, not Stop this, letting them out of their cages. <laughs> uh, this one is not great, I'll tell you that. Oh, uh -oh. okay. Um, I have a thirst for revenge. Oh. I don't know if you guys knew that about me. Okay. Uh, okay. But very, I need to get my vengeance. Vengeance will be mine. Yeah. Uh, so damage my location three times. Uh, well, if you cannot sucks. place all three damage tokens, which I can't. Yep. So no, nothing's getting damaged. First off, I'm not damaging anything. Okay. Good. Um, I just lose one health. Out of four. So yeah, you're fine. Yeah. So can we talk about like safety practices when it comes to science equipment? Because <laughs> I feel like this gangster did not follow any. That's true. Yeah. It's worth noting if any of us die, we lose the game. Mm -hmm. Wait, so. we're a team? We are a team, but not like one of those loosey goosey teams, oh, okay. like in other Arkham <laughs> games, where like yeah, you die, it's, you're fine, you're okay. fine, you know, go down. <laughs> no, we're a real team where we care about each other. Right. We can't go on and save the world if any of us have lost. Correct. Mm -hmm. If any of us dies, it's all for nothing. <laughs> and might as well just throw in the towel. Yeah. Uh, all right. Uh, so let's see. Uh, only one reckoning symbol? Only one. I OK. Yep. You're welcome. Hunger for flesh. The ghoul hordes hunt for one. So th these ones are going to roll up here. And this like one's that. gonna roll. Oh, he tries to go there, yeah, but he can't. He's go so he's to gonna the go here. Location. <laughs> yes, good, good, good. All Great. right. So we discard these priority cards. Are you hungry for like ghoul flesh? Is that what's going on? You're like, come near me so I can <laughs> kick your butt harder. Like. Uh no, they're uh they're a whole there there's a whole horde of them. They don't have health and they uh they cannot be destroyed. What? So. What? Yeah, there's there's whole bunches of them. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> I hope I have something Wait, that so allows me to destroy non-destroyables. This will be fine. So he, they can move out of the ritual okay. location. Oh. So he won't linger they're, there They're forever. not staying there. Correct. Oh, he's, that's okay. good. He, he's oh. just going to rampage around for <laughs> the like... uh, for the entire map. It's really a bummer that these two are uh, linked up like that because they're just going to like go together. It's and, very unfortunate. I mean, I guess they could, they could be separated <laughs> if they hit like a one slot or something like that. If only there had been like a secret trail that I could have gone. Yeah. Ooh, a Apparently, secret, secret monster trail. I get really upset and where high heels are not conducive to prowling around. Yeah. Not walkways. <laughs> uh, we need a gate and some oh, monsters. Yeah. I was about to like just ready to pass this yeah, along. Yeah, I was no, ready let's, for that let's too. Keep going, you know. Skip the mythos stuff. All right, here we go. Uh, a little cube. Cube? Uh, Tesseract maybe? That's... I don't know. At the observatory? <laughs> 
Here we go. Good monsters. Good monsters. Only the best. Fingers crossed. Yeah, and then they go. Okay. All right. A little flying guy in there. That seems okay. And then. Uh, oh, all right. That's okay. all right. Yeah, he's only one. Is that like a little deep one or something? He's <laughs> only one. This guy goes here. This guy's going to come up here. And then he's going to go over here. Oh, no. Yep. Oh, no. <laughs> yes, we. Uh, we gotta clear out this whole area down yeah, here. Yeah, there's, there's, there's a lot of stuff heading towards the monster. The up the north is looking there, pretty okay. Yeah. yeah. Uh, all right. So this guy goes on over to okay, you. Okay. So starting with me, are we? Yes. No more monster stuff. No more monster stuff. All right. Here we go. Okay. Nope. <laughs> Hmm. Can't wait to talk to you guys about uh, these priority cards after the game is over. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'm really curious, like, what's going on over there? <laughs> is everything all right? Mm -hmm. Gonna put that with a seven. And I can look at this. I just can't place my priority until BK is Yeah, his. yep, correct. Okay, well. I need to draw a priority card. Oh yeah, I need to look because I got more options. Oh, the old twenty-five. Ooh, I have a feeling what I might know what's going on with your priority <laughs> cards. Right, you're you picking are... up a. <laughs> there seems to be a pattern. Ones putting down. <laughs> All right, I'm ready to rock. All right, let's do it. Uh, so, I'm going first here. Empty hand, move up to two times. Attack monster at your location for two damage. If you attack at least one horror monster, do for three damage instead. So I'm going to go one, two, come down to the science building. And I'm going to pick off a couple of these guys. Yes, please. Like these two. Please destroy. Boom. Destroyed. <laughs> All right. All right, so with my 11. Yeah. I decided that it was time for a soiree. Oh, Go of course. Up to one Ooh. time, then attack monsters at your location for two. Mm -hmm. So I guess I got him. There's no place that I can super do this. Oh, no. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Move up yeah. to one time. But where do I want to get to? I kind of, I'm just trying to move. Like, even if I'm, yeah. you know. Yeah, you can be at the student union. You can pick them off. I'm unloading my, you know, revolvers or whatever, but it's it's not doing anything. So then you're going to be there. Choose another investigator mm. in my zone, which is now green. Uh -huh. nobody. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> no! <laughs> that investigator attacks monsters, so I'm having a soiree by myself. Oh, Union, lonely and... soiree. Oh. oh, well. But you know what it was better than? Activating the purple monsters. <laughs> <laughs> that, that, that does yeah. seem accurate. So, that's an interesting choice. I kind of have to, like, take a nothing for, like, <laughs> my my, like, action versus... Yeah, versus doing something really bad. Yeah. <laughs> Sometimes nothing is the best thing you can do. Okay, I think it's me now. I think so. Yep. Here we go. Still have that thirst for revenge. Oh, no. Uh, in addition to my priority card issues, I might not have shuffled my deck that well. I don't know. Um, <laughs> so I have, this. Yeah, so I have to damage... My location three times, so like this is gonna be like the worst of all worlds because I get to damage this, but it's not three times, so oh, I can't no. place all three so damage, so I have to take a help. damage as well. Can you please leave the science building alone? <laughs> like, what is going on? I here? hate science. I don't know <laughs> if you know this about me. <laughs> I really don't like science. Like Bill Nye, my least favorite person. Oh, right? oh, <laughs> oh that's dear. too bad. All right. All right. So now that you've messed up the science building and caused untold numbers of property <sighs> yeah. damage, mm -hmm. finally, this is my other soiree, but this uh. is the bad soiree. So move up to one time, then investigate your location, then activate monsters in the orange zone. Ooh, yeah. Orange zone seems real good. Yeah. Uh -huh. yep. Where do I want to investigate though? I need to. I'm gonna get to Derby Hall. Yes. Unless I want to go. No, I want to get to the quad. Okay. Because then I'll be able to start mm -hmm. messing mm -hmm. these people up, and then I investigate. <gasps> so you will you will this take damage when those ghoul hordes move out of there. Uh, oh. Yeah. How many omens do we have? Enough. It's too late. <laughs> I'm already All right. committed. I get an item card. All right. Grab a grab an artifact there. Where are they at? Uh, the, just from this deck, this right deck. there. Right in front of my face. Do I get to play it on? 
just like this? Yep. Cool. The Xanthu tablet. I'll get to discard this item before after before or after you resolve an action card to seal any three walkways. Place those seals with the gray side face up. Mm, okay, nice. so that would be good nice. for like keeping some uh, some hordes from getting where we want them to be. Yeah, that could end okay. up being really good yep. since there's a lot of guys uh, or right monsters there, yeah. right around here that seem seems bad. Yeah, so I was just you know I had to go investigate the quad and ducking around from all those ghouls and happen to find a priceless artifact. Yeah, just just, just laying on the quad. <laughs> <laughs> What's this here? <laughs> Students leaving stuff where they shouldn't. All right. Yep. You so have to then, activate uh, orange, right? Uh, yes, activating orange. They mess up this building, and that's it, right? Uh, down here as oh, well. Oh, that's orange yep. too. Oh, that they don't do anything. They're not doing anything. Elder Faith saying, uh, Seminary. Mm. Yeah, that doesn't sound ominous at all. Elder <laughs> Faith. <laughs> <Hey>. <laughs> uh, all right, and then Reckoning. We've got two. So Hunger for Flesh. The Ghoul Hordes will hunt one. So this one is going. Oh yeah, he gets out of there. Okay, out of here. Yeah, that's great. These two. So you're gonna take two damage, unfortunately, uh, as these guys. Let me make sure. They just yep. run through. As they then... as they rampage through, so they're gonna try and go here. Can't. Boom. Boom. Well, you know what I'm gonna seal up is that student union, so we can't get any more. Yep. We want to give them an exit path though, so they're blue. Uh, oh, yeah. yeah, so they'll they'll go out this way, and they in fact ignore wards because they're it's just like a million ghouls, oh, and they're God. just like they're just having a good time. They're running around like crazy. Um, That's the worst. <laughs> all right, so we did reckoning and a gate. The gate. Good gate. Good gate. Good gate. Stargate. Okay. Yeah. And two monsters. If you please. And they just pop up at the museum. Yep. All right. So museum cultists. Yeah. Run of the mill. Uh, more cultists. Just ton tons of cultists hanging out. All right. So we it's very ditch our priority card. Culty campus. I got a. Is it time? Yeah. I'm gonna anoint it is time. you oh, as thank lead you. investigator. I'm in the lead. The leadest of investigators. The leader Let's of see. our team. That's right. Uh, ooh, ooh, this is a good one. Um, hmm. <laughs> All right, seems okay. I'm gonna say, put the 17 on that one. The old 22. The old 22. BK, you keep throwing out these low priority uh, cards. Yeah, I, yeah, I guess yeah. that you just, you know, always want to I'm use just, the second choice. I'm very, yeah. <laughs> You're choosing to do this. Michael McGlenn is feeling very lethargic. <laughs> All right. I'm sorry, everyone. I'm sure it'll be fine, though. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Uh, let's see. I think I know where all the good priority cards are going. <laughs> <laughs> it's just the energy is on this side of the That's table. Very interesting patterns is all I'll say. They're shuffled. <laughs> uh, I don't know. Uh, <laughs> don't look at me. <laughs> How many reckoning symbols do we have? Oh, okay. We have three. All right. Let's go. I guess it doesn't matter all that much. Okay. You think you can just do... not take this seriously? Does it matter all that much? That's not what I want to hear. Oh, no, it's, it's fine. It's fine. Everything's fine. Everything's fine. All right, what you got? Oh, yeah, because I go first. You do go first. Let's do this. Grand Gala. Move yeah. up to one time, then in turn order, each investigator attacks monsters at his or her location for damage equal to twice the number of priority cards. Oh, that's so good. Oh man, I can contribute perhaps. Yeah. Oh, no. oh, True. I mean. <laughs> so You're also at my location, so yeah. Yeah. <laughs> over to the auditorium. Yeah, we gotta stop doing this when we're at the at the same place. Because there's 
horrible things happening over there. And the monster that can move is like my prime target, so I'm gonna do two damage to this yep. mm -hmm. horrible Biaki Gribbly thing. Yeah. Do you uh, do you want to uh, throw down some wards potentially, or do you all hold off on that? Oh yeah, I should. Yes, I had this. I wanted to throw down some wards, and I I went before you should have gone, but I don't think that it matters for. Uh, damaging because starting with uh, oh sure there. sure 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 I see I see oh yep. uh, yeah so I'll just clear up these guys cool. oh yep I can't do anything <laughs> okay. well. you could trash the science building some more <laughs> I no <laughs> you know I mean. yes it's gonna don't give me any ideas kick some Bunsen flasks <laughs> so uh, I need some seals throw yes. down some oh, right there oh, you already got them for me yep so I think that um, We wanna. So you can. So these are the two paths into. We can seal it, even though I. That's not a walkway. Yep. Oh, sweet. okay. Yeah. Then I definitely. Because we seal the the monster paths. Cool. Full full strength here. Oh no! I oh think no! It, yeah, yeah. Oh, is it just sealed? Yeah, it's play with their gray side. Yeah. Oh, really? Oh man, I missed that. They're less, yeah. they're less oh. good. All right. So I think I'm gonna Darn, seal this. Man. Do we think that like it's worth doing this because we've got coming? Oh, down there the is that. Um. Uh, maybe. I don't think it can hurt. I mean, yeah. it's like more of a future proofing yeah. rather than like an immediate help, but. That seems okay though. Yeah, just. Uh, and, then the, and then we discard your, your, your Goodbye, whatever tablet. it is, tablet. You served me well. The Xanthu tablet. Xanthu tablet. Okay. What a cool name. Yeah. <laughs> All right. What do we got here? Pierce the eye. Uh, move up to one time, then attack monsters at your location for two damage. Uh, then move up to one monster at your location to an empty space at an adjacent location. So, okay, let's see. If I come up here, I can kill this guy. Do it. And then I can pick up this guy and throw him what? over here. What? I just threw him out the window. Wow. Yeah. I'm like, Jenny Barnes over here is like whirling around. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I'm Are not you gonna so mess impressed? With her. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right. So that was that, and then I do the other cards. So this is the low side. Move up to one time, then investigate your location. Uh, then activate monsters in the green zone, which is one through five. Um, I think I will move here to Derby Hall. No, to go the no, other. What you got? got a little clover leaf. Oh yeah. Oh, cloverleaf. Okay. Oh, a little cloverleaf. We've not yet eliminated any components, which is unfortunate. Yeah. But yep. we'll get there. Uh, then we activate monsters at one through five. So once so this, this guy's gonna run over here. Uh, he, 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 those try to hurt people. This guy's gonna stay here. He's at the ritual location, so he's like, I'm not leaving. Uh, three is the he's quad. Partying. That one's gonna damage the that fourth space there. That's not uh, great. This guy's gonna damage. These monsters and Michael are just trashing the place. I feel really bad. This is like a game about destroying a establishment of higher learning. <laughs> <laughs> we're trying to stop it. Well, I guess, I except guess for me, who just like just wrecks the science building yeah. for on purpose. Dubious reasons. <laughs> exactly. Like. Exactly. Uh, okay. Here we go. Are Looking for something. Are you, that Mr. McGlenn? All right. Uh, Move up to one time, then investigate your location. Let's do that part first, because it's the more fun part. Yeah. I'm gonna come over here. Yeah. And investigate. investigate here. Hey. Oh. Definitely not whole hourglasses All right. for sure. And that's the one you called at the beginning, I did. right? I did. It was foretold. Foresight. <laughs> uh, and then we're gonna activate monsters in the purple zone. Oh, all right. I'm glad that you took out those monsters, Evan. So this guy is gonna red. Coming He's coming over, over there. Coming yeah. over to your place. No one there. No one there. Uh, this guy is gonna go all the way over there. there. And it's, there is a there's a space. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Good. Just gonna good. Chill in the museum. And they're just gonna chill too. Okay, that wasn't nearly as bad as I thought yeah, it was, was going to be. Yeah, that was fine, so, that was fine. Okay, yeah. so count reckoning symbols, there are three. Three of them. Nowhere to hide, the ghoul hordes hunt for two. So this guy goes 
one, two, and these two go one, two. Uh, keep on keeping on. Yep, no. one of them keeps on keeping on. <laughs> Ducking these ghoul hordes over here. Oh, and then we have to, this actually comes into play, we do have to remove a seal of our choice from the board now. Oh. oh. I feel Probably like this that one. one, yeah. Yeah, because there's no red monsters there, so they yeah. don't have the lowest effect. There's no one coming along that way. Yeah, yeah. whereas there's other bad griblies. All the griblies. It was nice while it lasted. Uh, and then you want to <laughs> gate me, BK? All right, let's gate it up. Don't mess it up. All right. Triple circle. Oh, that's that's probably the best one that could have popped up. Good job. Oh, yeah. Just only three monsters hanging out right just there. Only. Just three. only three. Just three. We got the little flying guy. Uh huh. I think he's got wings. I don't know. He's. Or is he just like really like swole? He's. <laughs> I don't know what he is, but he's pretty disgusting. Oh, there's more of him. Oh, no. And then there's this guy's definitely, it's like a Biaki or yep. something. Oh, yep. okay, I'm got it. All right. All kinds of monsters over there. Yeah. All right, let's ditch some priority cards. And investigator. Here we go. Lead investigator. Oh, that's me. The most lead of all our investigators. <laughs> Take a peek here. That's funny. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. Here we go. Oh. Hmm. Oh, no. Don't want that one. Got some, got some good stuff lined up. I got some, I got some interesting, interesting things. I would say we're gonna go that. Okay. Draw one of these guys. Yes. Uh, if I can, you can do ah, it. I, got I believe. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So you played a fourteen. Sorry, everyone. All right. My hand was forced. Well. Do you mind if I start shuffling these up? Oh yeah, go go for it. Let's see. I want to play Ben. Uh, not that one. Play the number one. Wow, you just think you can go first like you that, huh? Guys. <laughs> you only got like high priority cards in them anyway, right? It's fine. Yeah, Man. Alright, well. <laughs> get like a 14 and I feel like I'm just... High roller. I know. Uh, Alright. Yep, alright. I gotta, some, got I, gotta, I gotta think about this now. Uh-oh. <laughs> You've only got four options, though. All right, well, you know, I mean, I guess I'll just... Um... Oh, no! Uh -oh. Wait, wait, okay. Okay, yep, and then let me check. Oh, I should have played it. Cross-reference. All right, well, uh, there we go. Cool, so got, cool. I could count on you for those high numbers. Yeah, all right. Well, it's it's shuffled now, so, like... Okay, well... Yeah, yeah. <laughs> we'll see how that goes. goes. All right, I'm going to meditate. Uh, remember the sunset on Mount Hua. Uh, resolved two of the following effects in any order. I'm going to, there's a bunch of effects, but I'm going to choose two. Oh, no. That is not, <laughs> I thought there was a connection there. No, oh, I mean, it's all these sneaky paths. Uh, like, okay. No, 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 no. It's a very confusing college campus. All I'm saying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Miskatonic yeah, 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 yeah. University might want to think about this. This is layout. not how quads work. <laughs> <laughs> all right, like this, there's already. I'm going to some issues here. Move, and I'm gonna seal. Yes, there. Yeah, right. gray side. We can move through the seals, right? Because we're not yep. made of evil. Correct. That's good. Correct. Anything I'm not, not made, made of evil. Benefits. <laughs> Just want to throw that out. <laughs> that being, it's a test. Are you made of evil? <laughs> all right. So we still. Yep. Yeah. Uh, okay, that, that is now all. Now I go. A color for all seasons. Mm. Fine Parisian lipstick, 70 francs. A well-painted ward, priceless. Nah. Uh, so resolve the following effects in any order. Move up to one time. Seal a walkway connected to your location. Oh, dropping like the seals left and right. Yeah. yeah. 
So I'll move mm -hmm. and then draw it to my location. So if I move to like here, my monster's not gonna come that way. No. I feel like this is kind of taken care of. Where do I wanna go? I'm gonna go here. Uh -huh. And then I will do a seal. Yep, there you go. Where do I put it? And it's like a full seal, it's not even a halfsy seal. Yeah, yeah, if it didn't say gray side face up, it's a it's a full on seal. I'm gonna pop one right here. Yeah. Because I don't like this whole yeah. rotation. What what is the uh, the color for all seasons? Just out of curiosity. I mean it has to be red if we're talking lipstick. I suppose. <laughs> <laughs> Fair enough. That's it? Yeah. All right. It's all you. This implies that she's making the ward with, with her, her lipstick, lipstick. Which is totally, I mean, you got to just use what you got. Mm -hmm. Right. I question how far it would be able to stretch, right? Like, <laughs> could you really, like, block off an entire, like, walkway? I bet you could. Yeah. yeah. I mean, you just got to do, like, the correct arcane sigil. Oh, yeah. okay. Yeah. Okay. So it's not like you're, like, painting it red or no, something like that. No, no. And it's still a waste of 70 francs. Yeah. <laughs> too bad. <laughs> For Jenny Barnes, do you really care? You're like, hey. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. Well, it was the sentimental value of the mm, Parisian good lipstick. Good point. Oh, good point. Mm. Yeah, that Parisian lipstick is hard to find. So especially, especially in our in our yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't found any on campus yet. All right, so that's me. All right, yeah. here we go. Uh, so bad news. Okay. Uh, only bad things are going to happen here. Oh, good. Uh, so move to one time. I can't investigate. I mean, I guess if you consider me moving good, uh, then I can go over here. So that's going to happen. Mm -hmm. uh, and mm -hmm. then we're going to activate monsters in the orange zone. Okay. That was right. a lot better earlier. Now uh, it is. So he, they can't do anything. This one, this one wants to move. He's going to go along here. And 13. They're just going to try and hurt people. Uh, he's going to uh, try and wreck his place. What happens uh, if he wrecks a place that he can't wreck no more? I'm looking that up right now. I, I should know that. Just kind of off the top of my head, but all right, blah, blah, blah. If there are no empty spaces, he moves out of the location. Okay, so he's going to wreck the place, and, and he's going to move. move. He's going to move on. It's like this place, what is it? Fraternity Row Fraternity is Row is, yeah, messed up. I feel like the frat brothers had a head start on that, though. Yeah, yeah they were, it was already. <laughs> far, there's only three spaces there. <laughs> but now he's in the ritual site, yeah. so we're going to want to clear him out of there. It's not great. Uh, and then this boy, he's going to slide along. This arc, and then this one, so he's going to end up right there. All right, all right. Cool, cool. There we have it. Cool, cool. Uh, so that, now you're that on my, my other bad card More here. bad stuff. Yep. All right. Uh, I get to move up to one time and then investigate my location. Okay. Uh, so here's where we can discuss things, because there's a lot of places we can go, or I can go here. <laughs> It's a lot of walkways. I'm in a central location. Mm -hmm. I can come like pretty much this entire, I guess I can't go over there. I can come here, here, here. Uh, where do we think, where's, where's it a good priority to investigate, you think? I mean, I guess if I come here, then I can maybe take care of that one next turn. Sure, that sure, sure, sure. Good. Okay, let's go down here. Let's yep. see what this bad boy is. It's or a little, little relic thing. All right, what do I got? I got a shining trapezohedron. Oh, heck <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it's very shiny. library, nice. Yeah, discard this item at the end of the reckoning step to attack monsters in any locations. All right, the total number of damage you assign is equal to the number of omen icons on the priority cards discarded during the step. Whoa. Well, that seems Interesting. okay. Yeah. There, and there's a lot of omens floating around right now. Yeah, I'm, mm -hmm. I'm chock full of omens. All right. Uh, okay. And that was all your all your turn, right? That was me. Oh wait, I'm sorry. Nope, because we have to do the the, the bad part. Yeah. Yes, yes. I don't remember. Lest we forget the bad <laughs> things happen. Uh, then we're gonna activate monsters in the green zone. Green zone, nothing. This guy's gonna start wrecking the ritual. Oh no, so that's real bad. Um, yep. Four or three? Who oh no, in? you're gonna take two damage off these boys. I have bad news. Oh no, is that game oh. over? <laughs> <laughs> Oh no! Uh, well, uh, rip. <laughs> yeah, in fairness, this is my first time playing, and you guys are like, we don't need to do easy mode. It'll be fine. Yeah, I mean, we didn't. You, you, you did very well. Yeah. <laughs> we all did well. So. No one could have known that Michael McLean was going to make that, those yes. monsters attack you. 
So what this is This is it? my fault. I... So that card is dynamite. So you you lit up an explosion at the Orn Library and then everything just started, you know... Freaking out. Freaking out, the heading my like, way, and then I just get trampled or something. Yeah, <laughs> yeah that sounds about right. Oh, like looking out the window, I just like... Can we all just like five thousand ghouls? Not to trust Michael McGlenn with dynamite going forward. Yes, yeah. yes, no dynamite. He's like a monster. What's he going to use it for? Like, mm, I guess. How are we going thing. to stop him from getting it, though? That seems like perhaps the harder part. Just take the card right out of his. <laughs> oh, there it is. There it is. All right. So this was Arkham Horror Final Hour. So we we, uh, we lost obviously, as <laughs> Did you can see. Did we make it an hour? Uh, no. In fact, <laughs> you're not supposed to make it an hour because this game uh, is supposed to play in under an hour because this oh, is cool. the, the final hour. So right? it's not an eight-hour Arkham Horror. Yeah. If everyone no. knows what we're doing and we're kind of like playing it, you know, uh, maybe not on a stream, uh, you could play it in like 45 minutes. Is oh, kind of cool. the ideal. Yeah. Yeah. It's just a really sweet, fun little game. I enjoy playing this quite a bit. Um, you can just break it out, get some Arkham action, blow up some monsters, and uh, and, and pack, maybe your pack teammates. It down. Who knows? And maybe your teammates. Yeah. <laughs> Whatever you got to do, yeah. man. Whatever should we uh, should we see what the little symbols were? I think there's Ooh. at least one moon under there. For that sure. that does seem the most uh, the most logical um, guess. In fact, I'm gonna guess there's no, no. moons just to be. Don't look. Uh, no, we're oh. gonna look. You don't have to show them. Oh man. Oh, oh Evan, I was Ooh. right. Oh man. Yes. <laughs> wow. Never tell me the odds. Yeah, wow. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, this is Arkham Horror Final Hour. Thank you guys, everybody, for watching. We stream every Tuesday and Thursday, so make sure you subscribe so you're notified whenever we post new stuff. In fact, we're going to be back this Tuesday if you're a fan of Arkham Horror the Card Game because we're doing an AMA with designers, Matt Newman and Jeremy Zwerner. We've got a forum thread open now where mm. you can go and submit uh, your questions in advance. Uh, it's going to be a good time. We're just going to hang out and talk about uh, my favorite game that we make uh, now, which is Arkham Horror the Card Game. Uh, follow us on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook. Thanks to Carolina Game Tables for this puppy. This is nice. Yeah, isn't it? Isn't yeah. it? It's very cool. It's, it feels nice under the fingertips. Um, you can watch this uh, on YouTube after the fact, and we will catch you next time. See you guys around.